Yo yo guys, here I am again in Swindon and this time outside the Thistle Express Hotel which is another one that appears to be closed to the general public. There's a guy looking there, but he's coming out now, this should be interesting. Let's see what he's got to say. Hi, I know. Oh, yeah, you yeah no. what, can center? you book a... Is there not a hotel in Russia? What are you doing now? I can't disclose that information to you. Why not? Because it's private and part of the Home Office agreement, I can't disclose oh, information. Oh, I see. Yeah, do you mind not filming me, please, sir? Um, this is a public place, I'm allowed to film it. Then I ask you not to film me. No, I'm, I'm well entitled okay. to do that. This yeah, is a but I'm well entitled for my own privacy, so please do not film me. Yeah, well, you're in a public okay. place, I'm allowed to. It doesn't matter, but you're filming me without so my permission. So the Home Office... You are filming me, you are filming me. It's the Home me, Office that say this, then. Yes, stop filming me, sir. Yeah, under the section of public order act. You're the public right section order. What, yeah. what section is that? Public order act. Yeah. Privacy and confidentiality. Okay. okay. So please do not film me. So this is the Home Office that said that then. No, I'm saying it to you. It's me. Okay. I own my personal private confidentiality. Okay. I do not want to be appearing on your film. Okay. Thank so, you. Okay. Yeah. Appreciate your but this is a public area. That's fair enough, but please yeah. do not film me. I am asking you, as a normal person, yeah. a normal person, do not film me. Okay. I won't okay. do that anymore. Okay, thank you for your help, sir. Thank you very much, sir. Bye-bye. See ya. So then, guys, as you saw from that very cagey security man earlier, they seem very keen not to show exactly what's going on here. Yeah? Very cagey, wasn't he? He started talking about the Home Office and stuff like that. But how convenient. Across the other side of the road, you've got the um, NHS um, building as well. I'm sure they're all using at our expense. I mean, don't get me wrong, right? I don't begrudge genuine refugees coming here, but as we saw, people outside smoking, like, they're in that age bracket again of um, 18 to 30, yeah? And they come across on boats, and they've got no business being here. Absolutely none at all. They're not fleeing anything. We know that. They're coming here for a free ride, and they're being funded by us, the taxpayer, and that's what's really starting to get on our goats now, yeah? We're paying for this at a time when our country is under unprecedented um, measures and infrastructure. You know, it looks like the goons are there, look, probably watch me down the bottom. Well, anyway, I'm signing out now, but, um, you know, these people need to start answering to what's going on, because this is totally unacceptable.